Uh, so it's Sunday morning. I'm back out here. Figured I'd try and put this door to bed. Get it behind me. But in the industry, construction industry, especially remodel industry, we've got these terms that we use. I, I call them ghost lines. And a ghost line is like a shadow of a caulk bead, or in this case, where the epoxy rolled up on the threshold. And you can tell that's where something was before. It's like a ghost. And then I got things I call a ghost door. Like, you know, you walk through your house and doors just sort of swing open by themselves. And, you know, it's like a ghost opened it. You know, they never really stay shut. So, came out here, nailed my door in, started flashing between the mullions, flashing down the side, again, thinking I'm finally there. And I came down here, and I said, well, damn, that's odd. Why doesn't my tape on my nailing flange line up with my mud seal flange. I just got to thinking, what the hell's going on here? And then I cut my fan off and opened the door and my door blew open like a ghost. A ghost door. See that? And I hate a ghost door because all a ghost door is to people who know what it is, is an advertisement that there's the ghost of a jack leg around here. And bad on me for even remotely thinking that these guys did anything fucking right at all. Because that little epoxy curb, that little epoxy ghost mark, made a little ledge. And so when we stuck the door in, we kicked it in the door till it hit that ledge, just like the one before. But I was a dumbass. Because I thought maybe they got the fucking door. Maybe they did something right, but that was stupid on me. There's a seal. Oh, what happened? They never had the fucking door in right at the bottom to start off with. So now this whole assembly's in a fucking rainbow shape. Got that semi-plum. And they got that semi-plum. But they never thought to kick the assembly in in a straight line. And I never thought I'd had to fucking do it because I had that curb there to kick it against. Now I got a ghost door, and I hate ghost doors. Because now instead of the ghost of a jack leg, now it's a ghost of me following a jack leg. I'm gonna ask the homeowner, I really don't wanna leave it like this, but she's pretty much done. That's probably something she can live with. But I gotta remember from now on, anything, I, I, I'm just gonna have to take everything to the very beginning, because I can't trust a fucking thing these guys did anywhere. Nothing. Any problem I find has gotta go back to the root, the beginning 
or I'm just going to keep building on problems. And the ghost of that man is going to be all over this house for as long as it's standing. I can guarantee you that. <laughs>